my name is Peter Stoichev and I'm the Dean of the College of Arts and Science. This is a unique college in the country because it has so many different kinds of departments, so many different kinds of programs and therefore so many different kinds of research interests. There's nothing else like it in the whole country. My name is Dylan Knowles and I'm a master's student from Unity, Saskatchewan with the Department of Computer Science. Hi, my name is Qin Xiang, a second year social linguistic PhD student. I'm investigating the ways to maintain Chinese languages of second generation immigrants in Saskatchewan. Hi, I'm Brittany Holmson. I study aquatic insects and how we can use them to forensically measure the impact of certain stressors on our streams and rivers. Hello, my name is Robert Henry. My studies focus on utilizing modified photo voice. So my name is Claire Anstead and I love the U of S so much I decided to do my master's and then my PhD. I'm Jason DeSano. I'm the director of the Social Sciences Research Laboratories. Last year, the SSRL worked with, uh, worked with more than 100 faculty members on 40 research studies, and 50 of those faculty members came from the College of Arts and Science. Those 40 research studies involved more than 300 undergraduate and graduate students from the College of Arts and Science and beyond. And uh, we're already starting to see some of the early benefits of, of or impacts of the SSRL, as the SSRL produced more than 80 uh, publications last year. My name is Graham George. I'm a Canada Research Chair. Uh, my research revolves around the use of synchrotron light to determine chemical details about metals and living things. One of the neat things about this campus, and it's actually unique within Canada, and maybe unique within the world, is we actually have a synchrotron on the campus. All of those, all of those facilities go together with the signal to make something very special and quite unique. It's unique because it has tremendous breadth of interest and academic activity and that means that the kind of research scholarly and artistic work that goes on here can be very interdisciplinary and very different from what you can see elsewhere. But there is a lot of community-based research that goes on here that uh, takes researchers out into Aboriginal communities throughout the province, that takes researchers out into outlying communities where environmental issues are important, where economic issues are important, where political issues are important and they are doing their research out there for the benefit of these different communities.